here tonight to honor the artistic growth and the artistic achievement of 10 of our student artists. They have every reason to be really, really proud of their work. There's a lot of aspects to being an artist. There's the technical skills, and there's the expressive skills and expressive qualities, but they also need something to express. And one thing that you may not know if you're not familiar with the IB curriculum is that they spend a lot of time identifying and developing their inner voice. And that means that they spend a lot of time thinking about who they are as people and who they are as artists. Really, I was, I was really interested by the skull because I think it's interesting. <laughs> but many people would really think that's scary and it's death or something, but I think, yeah, I, I love skull because it's sort of symmetrical and it's got a lot of detail. And yes, yeah, so I later did a series of works on skulls. I have um, film photography. And I considered I, myself a cartoonist, I guess, when I started uh, last year. And that was like the mad dog, kind of husky bulldog thing in the corner over there. Um, and then I got into photography and like fell in love with it. And so some of my strongest pieces I think are my photography. This year I began working to add new media to my photography. I was very interested in growing and expanding as an artist, and I found it fascinating how different media can create one unified piece of art. And as I grew as an artist, they became more and more personal, and the closer to me they were, the more time I would actually put in them. This year and last year, with the help of Ms. Chef and Ms. Wilson, I was able to discover my talent with abstract art, which is, you can see all my art right here. Um, what I try to focus on is really capturing my emotion or my current situation and then portray it in a way that the viewer of my paintings or drawings would be able to see and feel it. So that like, horse up on the left side, that's my first painting. It wasn't actually part of my CRB because it wasn't really, it's not really amazing. So, um, but basically I want to put it up there to show growth. Well, I'm really interested in like, how we are changing the world and how are we like destroying the nature and things like that. I was diagnosed with a heart condition in September and all my artwork reflects that. I guess I used this class because I was focusing so much on research to look at things I was really interested in. Uh, as you can see, like, I have done a lot of screen making. Uh, and I have done some um, dissections, photographs, and programs. 